This morning, stunning aerial images from southwestern Iceland, capturing a late night eruption, spewing searing hot lava from volcanic fissures. It comes after weeks of anticipation and earth shaking seismic activity. Icelandic officials say the eruptions brought on by a swarm of earthquakes Monday night, beginning northeast of Grindavik, a fishing village where a state of emergency was declared last month. The entire population of 4,000 people evacuated as a precaution. It's the fourth volcanic eruption in two years and the largest so far, with an initial fissure opening spanning three miles and lava shooting over some 300 feet into the air. It's just fascinating to see just nature in action. I just, it's just like something from a movie. The Icelandic Coast Guard surveying the area overnight in an effort to confirm the eruption's exact size and location. Passengers at one of Iceland's main airports, just 16 miles away, reacting. As soon as they know anything, we will let you know. Authorities have raised the country's aviation alert level because volcanic ash can pose a risk to engines on passenger planes, something that happened when another volcano erupted in Iceland back in 2010, creating an ash cloud that grounded air travel in Europe for more than a week. Monday's eruptions follows weeks of intense seismic activity that spurred thousands of earthquakes, prompting the closure of the country's iconic Blue Lagoon. Now officials are stressing vigilance and caution as the region waits on Mother Nature to run its course. Now, big picture eruptions are unpredictable. Of course, Icelandic officials say those lava fountains that were hundreds of feet overnight are down to about 100 feet, so that's good news. Now, airport officials say at this hour there is no disruption right now, so flight schedules are running on time, and that means no disruptions at this time throughout Europe. Hoda. All right, Molly Hunter Force there in London. Molly, thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.